Hey guys, on my last video I got several questions from folks wanting to see the internals. So just a quick video to show you the internals and how to get there. Dell made this super easy. It literally takes one standard Phillips screw. You go ahead and unscrew this screw here. I didn't remove the screw. I don't know if it stays in or not, but I left it in. And then the best and safest way to do this is to use a plastic pry tool like this one I'm using here. Um, I did have some issues because I was concerned it was going to break. Um, but if you just go ahead and do it, it's the recommended way to do it. And as you see, I had to put some more force than I wanted to, but once you get the top off, everything looks good. If you'll notice the left fan, there's a piece of plastic in there. I don't know exactly what it was from. Uh, I'll zoom in here on that in a second, but you can see all the main components. Yeah, so if you look at this, I mean, it, it, it's like a clear plastic tube that's open on both ends. Um, I'm really surprised I didn't hear that when the fans were running. Maybe it'll run quieter now. Again, Dell, take notice. What the heck is this thing? So, other than that little mishap, Dell did a good job of making everything accessible. Um, it's very easy to upgrade with there only being one screw. It's a nice bit of kit.